So we got Mike Wayne courtside report. He's going to be talking about gameplay. Let's see what he has to say. To our first NBA 2K25 courtside report. Today we'll be talking about gameplay, which is powered by ProPlay. I'm Alexis Morgan, and joining me today is gameplay director for NBA 2K25, Mike Wang. Mike, what's going? on? I wonder if Mike Wayne knows, like, like, look at his face. Like, he's, like, smiling, but there's also, like, a deep sadness in him because he knows his game is terrible. What's going on? Oh, it's great to be here, Alexis. Oh. So Whoa, what was that? Oh, my God. Look, 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 look what they did. They gave us, they gave us something. What's going on? Instead of that cinematic trailer that they gave us earlier. Oh, it's great to be here, Alexis. Watch it. Oh. There it is. Wow. Okay, so we got a new uh, scoreboard. Not too bad. Um, everything else is pretty much the same. Just uh, the scoreboard. Uh, how's the how's it running though? Here That's the NBA thing. Two K twenty five, Mike. <laughs> this is the most gameplay you're gonna get, by the way. Wang, Mike, what's going on? Not the cinematic trailer. That, that's that's nothing. Uh, oh, it's great to be here, Alexis. Oh. So Pro Play is an exciting look new too bad. technology that we introduced last year, and it allows us to take real NBA footage and translate that directly to the on-court gameplay. Mm. So it brings uh -huh. a whole new level of realism and authenticity to the gameplay experience. No, you're just more lazy. That's all. all that's so that's really all Pro Play is. Like you're trying to implement this new thing that you guys been trying to implement for the last past three four years, but now you guys finally put it in the game and it became terrible. And now we're just waiting for it to be good. We're waiting for it to be good. We need a couple more years. That's it. Uh, we need a couple more years for it to actually be good. So what can you tell us about the new dribble engine in NBA 2K25? <laughs> oh, well, hey, man, we gotta rewind. <laughs> you, you gotta rewind. So what can you okay, um, what is going on here? Tell us about the new dribble engine in NBA 2K20. It looks a little bit quicker, actually. A little bit faster. So this is the only gameplay you're going to get, by the way. These little uh, two-second snippets. Uh, let's see. What can you tell us about the new dribble engine in NBA 2K25? Oh, wow. This is one of the most amazing upgrades that we've had to our engine, probably in 15 years. So what the, the the newest the newest thing or better thing? Oh, this is one of the most amazing upgrades that we've had to our engine probably in 15 okay. years so um, this is a new dribble engine built from the ground up oh that was cool i liked it that i liked it engine that probably in 15 years so um this is a new dribble engine built from the ground up that that takes basically all these pro play animations that we have over 1500 animations and it uh -huh. dynamically creates all the movement and all the transitions that you need to make the dribble move exactly the way you want it to move. I don't know about that, man, because I, when I used to dribble, I couldn't go where I wanted to go in pro play. We've had 9,000 new pro play animations to the game this year. No, you don't. No, you don't. Don't have 9,000 new pro play animations. Stop lying through your teeth. I see your teeth and you're lying. Stop it. A lot of them are shots, signature shots. So nearly every player in the league now has a signature shot. One of the cool things that we added was this feature called signature go-to shots. So if you remember in 2K24, you could flick the right. Whoa, that looked like a crazy little uh, yeah, release was, there. This feature called signature go-to shots. Look at the release bar, uh, the shooting release, the green release bar, I guess we, you, you would call it. I don't know. I don't even use it, but so if you remember, look at that. It's like an arrow going up. Remember in 2K24, you could flick the right stick up and you could um, do a little size up sequence to get open, right? In 2K25, if you hold the right you stick up. You can't, you can't take that shot though. You can't take that shot. See this shot right here? Size of sequence to get open, right? You can't do that. You can't do that. Why? Because there's a guy right there. And you know what they call that? They call that 100% smothered. And he's nowhere near me. He's nowhere near me. The hand's nowhere near my face. But I'm 100% smothered, by the way, because he's in my vicinity. So, I mean, it's out of fix your game. So I can tell you in 2K25, if you hold the right stick up. And the only reason why he made that shot was because it was on rookie difficulty, by the way. You can do a size up sequence that branches directly into your jump shot. So it's a nice way to get open and get some shots off. You can't. You can't do size up shots and then get and then get open and then shoot it. No, you can't. No, it's not happening. No rhythm shooting. It's gonna be 100% smothered every time. I'm not talking about like how hard it is to do it. I'm talking about like when like the defense comes in, like when the defense comes in, like when the guy's nowhere near me, but his body is just like maybe two feet away from me. 
I'm, you know, I'm 100% smothered. Let's say a player wants to recreate moves from their favorite NBA superstar. How does pro stick rhythm shooting do that? Yeah, so pro stick rhythm. Okay, wait a minute, 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 wait a minute. From Hold their it. favorite NBA superstar. How does we got like, see, like this right here? So wa watch his body movement and the way his jersey moves. Pro stick rhythm shooting do that. Yeah, so pro. Okay. I don't know. Shooting is probably one of my favorite features of the game because it's just a new way to play, new way to shoot. So in the past, it's always been the same, right? You hold a button down, release it to get, to get your shot off. Yeah. With pro stick rhythm shooting, what you want to do is you want to try to match the rhythm of the player's shot. So you pull the right stick down, uh -huh. when he gets to the, his set point, you push the right stick up in uh -huh. rhythm with how he shoots in real life. So if you master rhythm shooting, you can actually be much better than someone who's a traditional regular button shooting. Okay, so he's saying that there's a big buff into rhythm shooting. Um, do we believe that? I don't know. Do we believe anything he says? I don't know. I'm just seeing a few little things here. I'm not seeing the whole shebang. Master rhythm shooting, you can actually be much better than someone who's a traditional regular button shooting. New shot if profiles. You know, just want to play casually. You're just picking up the game for the first time. Put it on low. Mm. Put it on real player percentage and just try to take good shots. And as you get better at the game and kind of master your timing. What the hell did this guy just say? Did he say put the difficulty low in real shot percentage? What am I playing then? Why do you want me to do that for? Percentage and just try to take good shots. And as you get better at the game and kind of master your timing, bump it up to high and you're going to see that you're going to perform way better than you did oh. with the other profiles. There's a new shot canceling feature. So what it allows shot you to canceling. do is to break out of any advanced shot. And just like the go-to shots we talked about, the signature go-to shots, you can break out at any time. So if you start one, you're holding the stick up, and then you, know, you see the defense collapse, or you see an opening, you can flick the right stick to do another move, to like chain out of it, or you can just throw the left stick and, and take a lay in the basket. It's like a oh. way more robust hesitation oh. feature. Oh, oh, okay, 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 okay. Mike, you know the saying, offense wins games, but- I'm not gonna lie, that's pretty nice. Uh, that's that's pretty nice. That's super nice. And take a lay in the basket. It's Boom, like a, see that? more robust. You see that? Where you, you, you just throw the left stick and, and take a lay in the basket. It's like Boom. a way more robust hesitation feature. Okay, it's not bad. Little like, small you know little implements. Offense wins games, but defense wins championships. So what is this? Am I gonna move like I'm stuck in mud? Am I gonna be money moving, or am, or am I gonna be soaring like an eagle? Which one? You want me to move real slow in mud, or am I gonna soar like an eagle? Which one? Which one? I wonder which one sounds better: moving in mud, stuck in dirt, and uh, can't move, or soaring like an eagle. I wonder which one you want to be. A2K25. Well, yeah, you know, defense is a huge part of the game. It's it's you know something that's. People don't always look at it as being the coolest part of the game, but it's the most important part, I think, to win games. So, um, you know, there's a number of new defensive mechanics and upgrades to this year's system. One of my favorites is one we're calling the defensive movement system. And so if you're holding down the intensity trigger, mm -hmm. you can slide left and right laterally or forward and back even, and you can cut off the ball handler. And if you can anticipate well and you, and you do it at the right time, you can cause them to lose their dribble or pick up their dribble. You know, if you're... Wait a minute. What did you just say? Like, I, I, I'm trying to understand and I can't. Right laterally or forward and back even, and you can cut off the ball handler. And if you can anticipate uh -huh. well... How do I do that, that though? ...movement system. And so if you're holding down the intensity trigger, mm -hmm. you can slide uh -huh. left and right laterally or forward and back even, and you can cut off the ball handler. And if you can anticipate well and you, and you do it at the right time, you can cause them to lose their dribble or pick up their dribble. Terrible. You know, if you're the on-ball, you know, lockdown defender kind of guy, uh -huh. then that's the thing you want to master. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. That was it. That was the only defensive thing that you implemented to the game, by the way. That's it, by the way. That, that's it. That's it. That's what am I supposed to do, man? Oh, God. Guess we'll see. Uh, new Learn 2K. How can players level up and get that win in NBA 2K25? Well, 2K25 this year is all about personalization and customization and access. And about VC and about really a lot of money that we're going to be making off little children. Um, so whether you want to take on some of the new stuff we talked about, the advanced rhythm shooting mechanic, or if you're less familiar with 2K, 
There's a new feature called Learn 2K off the main menu where you can jump in and whether you're a novice at the game or you've been playing for years, there's something for you to learn. There's... All right, do you see what he said? Just like, unless you're a novice at the game or if you're a veteran or whatever it is that you are playing the game. <sighs> He said novice, like he knows that he's still getting novice players coming into the game and spending VC. That's why spending VC, lowering VC prices will never, ever, ever go away. It's always going to be a thing because there's always going to be novice players coming into here that don't even watch YouTube. Don't even look, search NBA 2K because they don't care. They're buying the game to play a basketball game. And then once they do, they go ahead and spend the money. That's why VC is never going away. Okay, so let's give that up. Let's stop talking about VC and let's start talking about some gameplay. And so far, the gameplay that I'm seeing is very little changes and we're getting we're, we're getting two second snippets. So I don't, don't know. There's nothing I can really tell you about the gameplay, really. We still don't know. Madden gave you a full gameplay. It gave you full gameplay. This is giving you two second snippets. You have to like... Uh, uh, try to see if it's good or not uh, i can't see the gameplay but it's right there i don't know i can't tell so that's what they do basic tutorial advanced tutorials controller Whoa. mappings Whoa. Whoa. there's mini game Whoa. okay well <laughs> there's a little bit right there let's go ahead and rewind let's get our little three second snippet whether you're a novice at the game or you've been playing for years there's something for you to learn there's a basic tutorial okay um the name is like way at the bottom for some reason okay so uh advanced tutorials controller mappings there's mini game um it might look a little quicker tutorial, no? advanced tutorials controller mappings there's mini game i don't know i can't tell and all kinds of like just different ways to practice learn plays everything so hello anyway, hello 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 hello, hello 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 first place you should go Thank you so Oh my god, that looked it so bad. That's just my first reaction. Holy holy. Everything. So if you want to learn the game and get better at 2K, it's the first place you should go. Thank you so much, my Oh my god. Alright, well you're not getting a new game. So you're getting the you same thing. Learn the game and get better at 2K. It's the first place you should go. Thank you so much. Everything. So if you want to learn the game and get better at 2K, it's the first place you should go. Thank you so I don't know. I mean, Jason Tatum was moving pretty fast. Everything. So if you want to learn the game and get better at 2K, it's the first place you should go. Thank you so much, Mike, for joining us today and talk. See, we don't know if All this game... Like, just different ways to practice, learn plays. All right, so for Drew Holiday to make this shot right here, we don't know if it's on, like, Rookie, Pro, or uh, Hall of Fame. We, we don't know. You know, what? like, what is it on online, Superstar? So pretty sure. You learn the game and get better at 2K. All right, so he has a little bit of space here. First place. Go. Oh, dude, how did he get to the three-point line when he was Plays. nowhere near the three-point line? Everything. So if you want to learn the game and get better at 2K, it's the first place. Nowhere near the three-point line. His foot's over there, and then boom, boom. Okay, that's fine. Guess whatever. <sighs> See, this is what I'm talking about. See, this should be an open shot but look how it's not telling you whether you're smothered or not look how it's not telling you because we don't know if this this is the, this is on rookie you know Doncic is nowhere near his vicinity thank you so much mike for joining us today and talking through all of the new 2k25 gameplay features i'm so excited to see how pro play is evolving well thanks yeah we all are very excited so much for having me alexis and i want to give a big shout out and thank you to the 2k community this. What? Whoa. You want to shout out the 2K community for pooping on you? You've been pooped on. Thanks for having me, Alexis. And I want to give a big shout out and thank you to the 2K community. This uh -huh. is your feedback that helps us shape the game to be what it is today. He doesn't sound too enthusiastic about this game, like, at all. I mean, usually some years, like, he's, like, more, like, into it. Like, he's more happy about it. But this year, he's like, yep, we're going through another uh, bad time. Yeah, there's going to be another bad time. Oh, wow. Four different ways to pre-order the game. <laughs> you got the regular edition. You got the WNBA edition. You got the All-Star edition. You got the Hall of Fame edition. Jesus. September 4th. Still a long ways. Um, 
Yeah, man. Uh, we got to see some snippets, and the snippets were, uh, I don't know. Uh, I can't really say if it looks good or not. It looks okay. I mean, it looks like the same game, nothing different. And I think their pro play is just really, really bad. It's not good. <laughs> they added a few things that is new. A few, not a lot. Very few, which is fine because they have to add something every year so they add very minimum things to their game so that way they have it for next year i get that that's totally fine i mean you guys are a yearly game i don't know but this looked like it was in shambles like, like the whole interview like it was very depressing it was a depressing inter interview for some reason um gameplay looked dull it looks very dull no like it looks dull or am i crazy i, I feel like 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 there's no color Color the game. Superstar, how does pro stick rhythm shooting do that? What the hell? Rhythm shooting do that. Look how dull this looks. Where's the color? Where's the vibrance? Where's I mean, what 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 am I on? I'm on full 1080p. Literally, it says HD over here. What am I watching? I seen dull two snippet um gameplay, and I got a bunch of birds from Mike Wayne that I didn't really you know get excited for madden on the other hand is going to be really good because that game looks really good it's it's a total new game if you guys don't believe me i mean just get the game i've been playing madden since you know madden 05 like seriously like no joke like i've been playing these sports games for a very long time and i can tell a difference from a game 2k is not going to change madden is going to change this year just like college football it's going to have that college football feel but a little bit different that's all i'm saying I'm not saying that man is going to be one of the best maddens ever it's just it's going to have that college football feel and everybody's been having fun with college football everybody's enjoying it so madden is going in type in that type of gameplay route you get what i'm saying it's not taking a total 360 turn into college football but it's taking that route so it's going to be good i know it is because i'm having a blast with college football 2k on the other hand yeah i don't know man seems like another dead year who knows i could be totally wrong and this game could be so good we just need more gameplay man i mean we're getting you know that second snippets it's kind of hard to tell but i guess we'll see